Hilo High School offers four years of Japanese language. Students will practice how to communicate and present on a very familiar topics using a variety of words and phrases that they have practiced and memorized. Hiragana and katakana letters will be introduced in practice, and students will read and write learned or practiced words and phrases in hiragana and katakana. KVX Mira interviewed current students in the course to see what it is like. Well, Shihata Sensei is constantly engaging us in discussions and conversations in Japanese, and that allows us basically to constantly be thinking and answering back in Japanese. And I think that personally allows me to feel more comfortable in speaking Japanese and understanding or like comprehending it. And it makes the class a lot more fun too, because we're all learning together. So sometimes we have uh, foreign exchange students come over from Japan to this school and we get the opportunity to talk to them and it's such a, it's quite an experience. It's really fun talking to people who are just so different from us and they're, and it's a lot more fun talking to people who are just so fluent in Japanese and trying to speak English to us. In Japanese culture, we learn many things. We learn about yokai which are spiritual entities. We learned about karate. We learned about calligraphy as well. For the yokai, every morning or every so often, she puts on a slide about a random yokai, any yokai, and we have to describe it. And we usually talk amongst each other, which helps us because sometimes we don't know what it is, but other people do. And this, and you know, it kind of builds friendship. For karate, we had an actual karate teacher come in and teach us for a class and we got to learn from them, watch them, and at the end, uh, they looked at us and they gave us some instructive like advice on how we could get better, where to contact them. For calligraphy, we did it a couple times. Sensei taught us how to grind the ink, she taught us how to write properly, and then she taught us how to do some kanjis. We did some practice first, and then we proceeded to go on to do the real thing on a calligraphy paper. And Sensei even let us take it home, which was pretty fun. Uh, sometimes we'll do like cooking activities with like different cultural foods from Japan. Uh, recently you made like usagi manju, which is just manju in the shape of a bunny. Uh, I know that freshman and sophomore year you'll usually make like mitarashi dango, which is mochi, and gyoza. Uh, but yeah, cooking in Japanese class is a lot of fun and it really teaches you more like of what you use Japanese for in everyday life. Konnichiwa minasan, hajime mashite. Watashi wa Kami Wangu desu. Ima daigaku ichi nensei desu. Hiro kouko no toki nihongo o naratte imashita. Shiata sensei no nihongo kurasu o ususume shimasu. Hello everyone, it's so nice to meet you. My name is Kami Wong and I am currently a freshman in college. When I went to Hilo High School, I took Shiata Sensei's Japanese class and I highly recommend it. I would say my favorite parts of Japanese class were the lessons themselves and the food. Even during online learning, Shihata Sensei always had engaging lessons, whether it be using anime characters to teach us or interactive activities. My senior year, we even made okonomiyaki over Zoom, which was so much fun. It was delicious and I still use that recipe to this day. So if you're looking to study Japanese or are unsure what language to take, I highly recommend Shihata Sensei's class. Even if Japanese might seem daunting at first because it's so different from English, I I promise you, she'll break it down, ask her questions, don't be afraid, and it'll be so much fun. Um, you get to learn about the language and the culture, and you can make really good memories along the way. Um, thank you so much. Arigato gozaimashita. Thank you to Kami Wong for sharing her thoughts as a Hilo High alumnus. To sign up for Japanese, check it out in the course catalog.